Yeah, it's definitely not one to see common at all. Alright, so we're getting kicked off on VS2. Of course, the Gordo gets launched. You gotta start it out with the Gordo. 15% already just from a reflected Gordo. Vinny, just constant pressure right now. Uh -huh. Already putting Jericho in a ledge trap situation. Ooh, Jericho. I'm getting the combos going. Almost catches the air dodge in, but couldn't follow up. Down, Down throw forward, forward air. Bread and butter. And that one to overcommit, you know, just retreat, throw a Gordo, maybe reset to neutral a little bit. Right now they're just playing Batman with the Gordo. Honestly just, though. Back and forth. I think that's one thing I really like about watching Spitty is that his awareness of the Gordos is always really good. Oh. You know, uh, whether he's throwing it or sending it back at you. Right. It's he like, rarely gets hit by like a uh, send it. Like that's really only when it happens. <laughs> Although only two percent deficit right now. Ooh, Jericho not gonna take the first shot. That DI is crazy. It went right to the corner. That was perfect. That's gonna do it though. Jericho taking the first stop. 126.7%. All Jericho has to do is really just not do that much. Just keep his distance. I'm not gonna lie. I didn't know that Corrin's neutral B, like even uncharged, will send the quarter back. Mm -hmm. Anything that does 3.1%. Uh, 3 oh, is that the threshold? 3.1? Yep. Okay. So some jabs can send it back, like Bowser could jab it. Same thing, same with Samus. Mm -hmm. It sucks in good South tries to get that stage control, but Jericho sliding right past him with that bullet. Sets up a less trap, gets the episode. Shots of the is not gonna come down just in time. Nice back air. Ooh, will is that, that kill? kill? Oh. Almost though. Yes, that'll be. It will kill. Mm -hmm. I expect him to cancel it so he can grab right there. I guess he wanted to try to get the max distance but realized he couldn't make it. Getting getting hit by DDD's neutral being just like getting sucked up by him. So demoralizing. Oh, uh, it's just like, uh, stupid. <laughs> oh god, that can be taken out of context. No one clip me, please. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, even game. Only 10.1% on a heavy. Honestly, I think this match would just go to whoever can let's try the best. Like, I feel so stupid. He can keep Jericho on the edge. He can like, so Jericho can continuously contest stage with him. He can so I did like that little interaction that they had. Spitty was charging the forward smash, and Jericho tried to charge one back. No one knew it outrange it. But Spitty just dropping it, letting the splash hitbox in him. Oh wow, that Gordo didn't do anything. <laughs> Spitty's trying to find a way to get Jericho off his shield, but he can't really find the space to do so. That's gonna hurt. That's gonna do it. Wow. And knowing that he couldn't really box with Jericho, so for him to get advantage in that situation, he actually disengaged to the platform, disengaged from the whole situation to the platform, waited for his opening, hit him on a falling there to up air, and that allowed him to take advantage in order to do things like this. I enjoyed that. And like, just knowing that he was gonna get hit by that Gordo right there, just walk up, Boom, up tilt. Wow. Spitty, up 1-0 right now in this series. Boom. I wonder, um, I wonder what Jericho's adaptation is gonna be like. Okay, so we are going to Battlefield. Which is a very good stage for four. He does with juggles. But Jericho continues to juggle. He can get those juggles all. This is probably an easy, an easy game. But it all depends if he can get those juggles. Will he, will he allow Spitty, Spitty to land? So. And that's definitely an important part uh, of this matchup moving forward. It's just not giving Spitty time to catch up. Or not giving time to set up, I should say. Uh -huh. and you definitely just kind of want to take a lead, roll with it. Just constantly apply pressure. It's just 
scary whenever you're going up against a big team one with a hammer. And right now they're going tip for tat hits. This is something you really don't want to do against a super heavy since their damage output is so crazy. Mm -hmm. I love that option of using the fan at the ledge right there and swinging back in. It covers so much. Ooh, and that's going to hurt. Not going to kill you. Had the read right there, but didn't get any execution off of it. Turned around from the ledge and then... Right, setting back up. Ooh, I'm using the beefy up to hit that little bag. to continue the combo. Very smart. Yeah, how can... Oh, go deep. going deep yeah. for that one. Uses the star to keep him back on ledge, but that pin will reject that notion. Alright, good coverage with that high carry. Covered basically everything that you need. Getting hit by these borders is a really unfortunate time. Still, you know, in the lead, but positioning is everything, especially in a matchup like this. Spitty trying to get that dead hammer off. He's trying to make a way to just secure the stock. No down bro. Yeah, Jericho. Right just there, spaced just out enough too. Yeah, that pin. Recognizing that, hey, I'm not about to get hit by that. Alright, 117%. Now that is kill percent, but let's see if Spitty will be able to deliver. Set down to him. Or gets it right back to him. Ooh, nice air from mid stage. Oh. Wow. Yeah. Alright, 41%. Jericho can just keep Spitty above. It would not be a problem. Ooh. Look, ask and you shall receive. That's pretty much what's happening right now. Who's being able to get center stage again? It's not good. It's not where you want a King DDD to set up. Rolls past the forward smash, though. I want to see Spitty start punishing these rolls. Because obviously Jericho's not going to break this. Oh. Positioning for King GDD right now. Ooh, almost throwing the Goto. Well, almost getting hit by that Goto that can throw directly. That's what's in there. Just a chance to up to. Good punter side there from Jerry. I like that. Mm -hmm. Slides off the uh, edge of the platform. This side, please. That went well. Just run off the platform, turn around side B. Yeah. You know? well, sometimes it's the basic stuff that works. All right. So we got a game three going on. Yeah, we are tied in the series, one to one right now. It's a good matchup. Stop the and both of them have been even too. Which is something I really like. Like we've been watching them go back and forth this entire set. Uh huh. It's definitely very I'm gonna, I'm gonna hop off right now. I'm gonna let Makin take over for the rest of the set for this hey. game three. I have a match. Jeez. Yo, 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 you didn't need to say that, Kanari. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> That's our first time ever making it. <laughs> Wait, it is. Yeah. I realize. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, getting into game three. So we'll do it. Three, two, one, go! So 
day I was getting to FD in here. Um, not, it's not normal. I mean, <laughs> where you see like, you know, the battlefield FD. But uh, yeah, I'll, I'll start off a little bit, but I'm a bit taken back by this counter pick. This is, def this is definitely not something that Spitfire uh, counter picks together. Honestly, if you take a bit of platform from Korn, it really goes most of the juggling. Because Korn is really not that fast. Right. Okay, good, good string. This game is like relatively even. I feel like the pace of this game is going to like hard to favor the person who's still not the stock the first time. Uh -huh. Now Skitty has to come to the roll when that's gonna happen. Wait, what? Skitty has to come to the roll when that's gonna happen because it's just been kinda of getting on Scott. Well, never mind. Right, yeah. Takes it with the up tilt. Tries to get that up air off, but couldn't get it. Now it's a ledge trap situation. Can Jericho do something new and spin it? Well, okay, that was kind of smart, though. Using the, uh, the lack of a hammer and hitting your shield, ooh, get it off ledge for free. Back it in there, not quite hitting you. If Jericho, like, if he takes the stock, like, relatively early, he's chilling. But, uh, if I say that. Well, yeah, I'll spin stuff out of the way with this. Getting ledge trapped. Okay, get off ledge. One of these days, Spitty is just gonna turn around and that roller is gonna get murdered. Uh, yeah. Oh, gets the regrab. Oh, oh, falls out. But goes to the high. Ooh, high very high. awkward situation. And then Spitty just taking his time. He doesn't have to really. Oh, oh. That bear, I don't know why, but that bear looked auto canceled. <laughs> it was in the air right. and it had no lag. He, like, if that was at like 20, that would have true combo. Like, that bear came out so fast after that. Oh, <laughs> but, uh, Jericho sailing out, sailing out Spitty's first stock. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, the AoE hitbox hitting. Still big damage right there. Yeah. That bear is like Kylo Bear when it comes to ledge trapping. You cannot. It's so roll scary. Him, yeah. Uh, Spit back out, extra damage, and that's gonna be the death. I will do it. Spitfire moves on to top and eight. As usual, no handshake, but it'd be like this sometimes, I guess. Indeed, it does. Good stuff to speed it right there from capitalizing on that. Um, just honestly, just picked apart Jericho's habits. 